This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hi, I'm Susie Sun. Here's what's happening around Southern California right now. The wild waves pounding the coast are a big attraction. Dozens of spectators packed the famous wedge in Newport Beach to get a look. Dozens more grabbed their surfboards and headed into the water. It's been a very busy day for lifeguards, as you can imagine, who've been pulling people out of the water, and they're trying to keep less experienced swimmers away from the water. And take a look at this rescue this morning in Seal Beach. Two lifeguards pulled a man from the water. The man was able to walk away once they made it to shore. And the surf is having an impact on PCH. Sky 9 caught the backup in Malibu. This is at Las Flores Canyon Road. There was gridlock for more than two miles coming from the Santa Monica Pacific Palisades area as drivers slowed down to take in the gorgeous view. And some baby penguins made their public debut today at the Aquarium of the Pacific in Long Beach. You can get a chance to name one of the four chicks by donating to the aquarium. And for the latest on these stories and your news any time of day, be sure to stay with CBS LA. Well, greetings, everybody. I'm weathercaster Kai Goldberg. We had a beautiful day today throughout the Southland, making our way halfway through the work week downtown, making it into the 90s, the low 90s. We're still looking at some big surf out there as we make our way throughout the rest of the week as well. That high surf advisory will stay in place through Friday, where our temperatures will come down slightly. As we head into the weekend, we'll stay dry. We're looking at mostly sunny skies, mid 80s, and we'll stay in the 80s all the way through next week. That's your seven day forecast. I'm Christine Leahy with a look at Southern California sports. USC's Josh Shaw admitted today that he did lie about how he suffered sprains in both his ankles over the weekend, saying that his story of rescuing his seven-year-old nephew from drowning was in fact a lie. Shaw has been suspended indefinitely, and Coach Steve Sarkeesian released this statement today. Quote, we are extremely disappointed in Josh. He let us all down. Although this type of behavior is out of character for Josh, it is unacceptable. I believe Josh will learn from this. For all the latest scores any time of day, just head to our website, cbsla.com. And that's your cbsla.com news brief. Remember, we're always on. And be sure to click listen live to hear KNX 1070 News Radio and our other stations anywhere you are.